The expedition mapped more than 36,000 acres of the seabed between Catalina Island and Long Beach. The underwater vehicles found more than 100,000 debris objects on the seafloor in the San Pedro Basin. A quarter of those were deteriorating barrels. Scripps researcher Eric Terrell says it's the first time for an underwater mapping project of this scope. Really kind of the first of its kind, you know, really kind of pulling back the covers to see really what's been lying under the seabed here for, for decades. The area was a notorious dumping ground for industrial waste. Shipping logs indicate more than 2,000 barrels of DDT lace sludge were dumped there every month for more than 14 years. Scripps researcher Sophia Merrifield says the dump is more than twice the size of the island of Manhattan. We were able to classify 27,000 of those as barrel-like. And the extent of the detects was really widespread, and there were distinct patterns in those um, detects. Those patterns reveal how ships dumped waste as they moved over the site. Terrell's team is working with the data they collected in March in hopes that it could lead to an action plan to deal with the underwater dumping site. Eric Anderson, KPBS News.